All right, today is Sunday, um, was it August 9th, 2009, and I'm pretty much finished with this painting. I just wanted to show it to you because I'm real happy with it. I've got three pelicans, I've got two male pelicans, a female pelican, and this painting's been sitting around for, what, six months or something in the house, because I started way back then. And um, then I had this pirate flag, and this is coming from an actual photograph that I took with a whole bunch of pelicans and the pirate flag down at um, Everett's, no, nah, let's see, no, not Everett's Seafood, but right in that area somewhere around Fulcher's Landing. And so I wanted to just pick, uh, you know, three birds. I like three or something usually. And so I've got one female and two males, and they're kind of like looking curious at each other because they like her, I think. And uh, then the pirate's like, ha, 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 he's a full of doom and bigger there. So um, what I wanted to do was make it like it's kind of realistic, but yet almost cartoonish in a way too. So you see a little bit of both. You see some natural colors in it, and then you see some bold outlines and stuff. Um, this is acrylic paint, and this is kind of an isolated caricature of three birds and the pirate. And so I'm calling this Pirate's Perch. And so I think it would look really good as a, a piece that could be put in um, a beach house or just for fun or a poster or something. Um, I like to do things like that occasionally because um, I'm pretty much known for the Sneedsbury sneakers and um, they kind of like brought out my cartooning phase that I went through way back when. I'm going around the corner here because and I'll probably have to paint these edges when I get this thing down. But um, I'm trying to show kind of a waterline here but I just painted the whole background the ground, they call it, a uh, blue, and then took charcoal and sketched out the birds and the pylons, and then I left it for a long time. So then I finally started just working on it, Shrimp Festival weekend this year, and yeah, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about it. I don't want to upset too much right now because I'm just doing little things to try to bring out the wood and the, the poles and make them look very rustic because down by the water they're outside all the time with the salt air the birds all over them and stuff you know and uh, so they're rough so like I say it's a little bit of a crossover between real and abstract Josh what you can do is follow me over to Her Majesty which is on the other side of the room so we can show I'm more realistic now. Anyway, this is uh, Her Majesty, and I did this. Gosh, what year was it? 84, I think. And uh, I think I wrote it on the back. But this is watercolor. Um, not the same set of birds, but I took this picture of a, of a bird down at Fulcher's Landing, and she just, I guess she was holding her wings out to dry them a little bit. And so I just I played up the fact that she's a beautiful bird, even though she's not the male species uh, that's usually so colorful, the white top and the, the blacker looking feathers and all. And I, I threw in some purples into her feathers and all. Just a delicate grayish purple. And then when I framed it, I tried to pick up a pink and kind of a, almost an orangey, slightly orangey gray here and of course a marble gray mat and it's just my favorite one of my favorites i got i call it a collector piece and i'm real proud of it so thank you for looking at my family